How you going guys, Saltwater Fish in Queensland here for another Freshwater Fish Keeping Friday. As you can see on this screen uh, right now, um, this is my tropical fish tank, it's four foot long. Um, I've got all sorts of fish in there from live bearers to these neon tetras. Uh, lovely little fish, neon tetras. <clears throat> yeah, so uh, let's get into it, let's get some underwater footage uh, in the tank. Stick chin guys. Alright, so as you can see, we've got the uh, underwater footage here of, um, of the fish inside my tank. Uh, right there is my, um, there's my little neons. Uh, neon tetras are really cool little fish. They, um, not, they don't glow in the dark, but they're reflective of the light, and it, it really adds to an aquarium when they're in um, like a planted aquarium. As you can see, I've got a big bubbler up the back that shoots out lots of bubbles, like a bubble curtain. Uh, this is one of my um, pregnant... Swordtail females. Uh, yeah, so I've got lots in there. I've got, um, as you can see there, sunburst platy, got a Mickey Mouse platy, uh, some mollies. Um, I've just recently added some bristle on those babies uh, in there too, so they're pretty cool. Um, but yeah, no, so that that that's uh, that plant there is wisteria. That's one of the other. That's one of the plants I got in there. I've um, also got that rainbow shark right there, his name's Xerxes. Um, all up, it's really easy to keep all these fish. All you need is a heater, a filter big enough to pump the water around. Um, and uh, and uh, as I've got there, an air pump that shoots out bubbles that oxygen o oxygenates the water. Oxygenates the water, sorry. And uh, yeah, puts water in there. Um, so I've got, um, I just feed them just normal fish food. Uh, these things here, they're, um, uh, what do they call them, Blue Widow Tetras. They're just a, I wouldn't suggest buying them. Um, they're like a, uh, what, what do they call them? Uh, it's like a glass fish and then they inject it with paint. It's not really nice for the fish. Uh, so, yeah, there's me. Uh, that's my fish food that I feed them. So, yeah, it's just tropical fish food flakes. Um, yeah, so that's basically my tank. Um, it's really cool little fish these ones, uh, I enjoy keeping them, they all, um, they all stick to themselves basically, they're, they're all pretty, pretty, uh, docile things, they're not, they're not attacking each other or anything. Um, another thing to mention is they're all live bearing fish, uh, they're usually the cheapest and they actually produce their own offspring without laying eggs, they just, they're, they're pregnant and then they, they're pregnant for three weeks and then they have their babies, so. That's a that's a cool thing to know. So yeah, so that's that's the that's the horde of uh, little fish I have. And there's Xerxes, the um, little fella. I've also got a baiter in there, or fighter fish, whatever you want to call them. Yeah, I don't think he's in this video, but he's going to be in some future ones. So yeah, he's pretty cool. So yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. I'll leave you to it for another couple of thirty seconds or so, and. Um, let you just see the uh, wonders of my little tank. Hope you enjoy, guys. Saltwater fishing Queensland out for another freshwater fish keeping Friday. Cheers, guys.